Hey guys, Cadillac CTS 4, uh, 3.0 engine with the 6L45 transmission. I'm gonna show you how to put some fluid in it and uh, check the fluid. Uh, it's got, this This one here is an all wheel drive, so you have to take the drive shaft out or we couldn't see any way to get to the field plug. I'm gonna show you how we did it and um, made it a whole lot easier on us and uh, Anyway, maybe to help you. So there's a bottle of what you're going to be uh, wanting to put back in this. Uh, Mobile One uh, Synthetic LV ATF HP. So uh, that's the fluid that you need to use for this transmission. And just in case you want to know, this is what we use to pump the fluid back in there with. I'll have a link for this pump because this is real hand. These are real handy little pumps for us to have around. They do a real good job. All right, so we got the 6L45 transmission. Uh, the plug is right up in this hole right here. The plug you're gonna take out to check the fluid with. This car needs to be running in park when you check this fluid. Uh, we don't have the engine running. I'm not going to pull the plug out because we've already got it full of fluid. I'm just showing you how. Uh, I have another video uh, on uh, putting a front seal in this transmission. And while I had the pan off, I show you what you're trying to accomplish when you fill this up. So uh, what we did was we pulled this plug out. And, and then when we got the plug out of it, we um, uh, got us a fitting to go up in to where the plug is and we pump the fluid in this way instead of going into the side and taking the fill, actual fill plug out of it. We just left that alone because uh, as you can see, you see the drive shaft running right down beside the transmission and there's not enough room to get our hand up in there to even get to that plug. I'm sure it's possible, but it was just easier for us to make a fitting, get a fitting. So if this is the only thing that came out and you're wondering why you can't get fluid down in there, it's because this is not, this is not the refill plug. This just releases the refill plug. The refill plug is actually this part right here that is froze up down into the transmission. So uh, you need to get all of that, you need to get the whole plug out in order to get fluid uh, back into the transmission. Now we're gonna go over to a pan and I'm gonna show you what that you are trying to achieve uh, when you are pumping fluid in here and getting a fluid level. I'm gonna show you the inside of the pan and what you're trying to achieve when you're filling it up. The fluid comes in and starts filling up into the pan. And what it does is it fills up to this hole right here. You take the plug out of the bottom of the transmission pan. Uh, the plug is right up in this hole right here. And with that plug out, what you're doing is filling the pan up and the fluid comes right out this hole right here when it's full. It would fit.